guys, Merry Gamer here, and welcome back to Skyblock Survival Season 2. Oh man, I've been doing quite a lot of grinding, and we are practically done. Unfortunately, I got my ass handed to me by a witch just a second ago. Um, I need to go get my stuff back in a second. Uh, but as you can see, I've done a small little extension here, actually. Um, the reason behind the extension is we needed snow, and I can Oh, hi, guy. Uh, we needed snow, and, um... Yeah, this is where I died, so hopefully... Okay, I got majority of my stuff back. I didn't get everything. Um... Yeah, I, I, I needed, uh, snow, and, uh... So I had to do an ex... But just have... Okay, we've got a few endermen around here. I might have to try and kill these guys. Uh, yeah, so, so I had to build the platform up there, and I had to level it, so I had to put... Uh, I put cobblestone fences around it, and I put another set of half slabs over the top to make it full blocks, so that uh, we can get some stuff going. Uh, we've also we've also got enough. Uh, did I put put it in here? Yes. Uh, I've been doing a whole bunch of grinding anyway. Uh, I didn't really know how much I needed. I uh, probably over grinded really because we're not going to really make that much of a house. Really, it's not going to be much. Um, we've, uh, I'll show you the stuff though. We have almost done everything. Uh, so, mob drops. <laughs> this is how much mob drops we've got. So, I've had, I have plenty of mob drops. We've got enough wool to finish it all. We have um, a huge amount of bones, gunpowder, decent amount of glowstone and redstone, actually. <clears throat> Seven ender pearls, which is a bit of a bother. I wouldn't mind getting all the ender pearls we needed. Uh, okay, that guy just teleported. I was thinking of punching him. Uh, but... What we're going to do is, I'm going to go back up here, got more stuff, that's wonderful. You just get so much, oh, that's actually my first glass bottle, I'm surprised I haven't had one before. Uh, but yeah, we're going to go up here, we need to collect the snow, because I completely forgot that we needed snow for the snow golems, and uh, it didn't it didn't really register in my mind. It was raining before, so hopefully there's there's enough snow up here to, to last us. Okay, there is a bit of snow, so we need, I think... What was it? Ten snow golems. So we need twenty blocks. And we get like, okay, we might have to. We might have enough. We might have enough snow up here. Hopefully we do. Um, I was building it when it was snowing, which is a bit of annoying. I kind of finished near the end. Uh, hopefully we can get enough. So, well, actually, yeah, we should have enough because that's going to make sixteen blocks, and we need another. Four. So actually, there we go. There's the 20 blocks that we need. So we actually don't need these guys anymore. So pew pew. Uh, and what we'll do is uh, we'll set the snow golems up here. Why not? Uh, why is there more snow popping? I didn't dig that much. Unless it's popping because of the sun. I don't think so. It does that though. Um, okay, that's alright. So, uh, yeah, so today's episode should be the uh, last episode of us building things. We might do a special episode after this, how I did last season, maybe, you know, have a fly around the island, have a look at what it looks like from a bit of a distance, and, uh, you know, maybe have a bit of fun with TNT if we're lucky. Uh, so, this episode, we're going to finish off the challenges. Uh, <clears throat> I don't know if we'll be able to do the Ender Pearl once, because of... Uh, not exactly having too much luck with it. This thing has like no produce like no ender pearls. All these ender pearls have been from killing mobs. Um, so we get we get so much stuff now. This is awesome. Uh, glass bottle. Okay, well glass bottle can go down there. Uh, pumpkins. Pumpkins. Food. Yes, I got the pumpkins that we need. Uh, so let's do that. We need to create ten of them, and then that challenge is done. And then we don't have to worry about them ever again. And uh, then we just need to do a small lake, and then a house. Uh, oh, there's an Enderman there. Do we do we dare try and attack him now whilst we have these... No, we need to go place these blocks first, and then go attack him. So, um, let's go get these guys there now. <coughs> so, yeah, I've, I've really enjoyed the Skyblock series. It's, um... It's, it's Skyblock's kind of something that's probably a bit more closer to my heart, I guess, because it was like the first sort of thing I did on YouTube was a Skyblock survival, you know, uh, at the current moment. The, my first ever video is still my, mo my most viewed video. Um, 
it's pretty cool to think that... Oh, oh, he attacks it! Oh, that's pretty cool! I didn't realize that. I was wondering what the hell was happening then. I didn't realize these guys... Okay, well, these guys will keep it clear up here then. So, um... Yeah, like, I, I guess I didn't... I never expected, uh... Skyblock, my first series, to be successful, I guess? Wait, how many have I... I one, two, three, four, five... Wait, did I just lose a pumpkin head? I feel like I did. Yeah, I lost a pumpkin head. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, um, the game just nicked the pumpkin head off me. That's weird. Yeah, I don't have... Okay, we'll have to go plant another one of these buggers. Do we... Did he seriously just like... Oh, nope, there he is. All right, yeah, just do that. And there we go. So there's the ten... Uh, snow golems, they're all up here. This is their little area that they can live in. Uh, they can keep that all nice and neat there. They'll stop mobs from spawning there and they'll fight them at the night, which will be pretty cool. So, now the last thing we need to do is all the uh, wool. And uh, then we need to get the lake going. And that's probably my biggest worry. Wow, that's a lot of stuff. Uh, yeah, we, we'll get the lake going and um, hopefully get some ink sacks whilst there. That's the only thing that's worrying me at the moment. I, I don't think so we're going to be able to do the ender pearls personally. I think they're just too much of an annoying challenge to actually do. Um, I really should just stop collecting this stuff and start just throwing it away. I started doing that with some of the stuff anyway because I just felt like it wasn't. there was no need of keeping some of these guys. We've got plenty of stuff, though. But anyway, uh, let's grab... Uh, we need 90, I think, in total. So that's 6, so then that's 70. Uh, 80, 90. So that's how much wool we need overall to do all the challenges we need. So what we're going to do now... Uh, we've got my sticks there and more sticks here. We're gonna, we need to make 20 paintings... Uh, so we're going to need to make some more sticks, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six. So let's do that. And then we need to make a whole bunch more. So let's get... You know what? Let's just use all you. It doesn't bother me. So when we do this, then this, then that. That should be enough sticks to last... To last us for the rest of this map. So there's the 20 paintings. You can knock them off our list of things to do. Uh, let's also go here. Let's put all our sticks back down here, I guess. Because we don't really need any more. Uh, let's go challenge items. Let's do that. So 20 paintings, 10 snow golems off the list. Uh, we have small lake, big house. Oh, build, build a house and all the wool types. So... Ah, uh, we need to we need to do a few things here. Uh, okay, we need to grab uh, some bone meal. We need to go to town on some of this stuff. Uh, so we can go over here and let's just light this up. Let's get as many flowers as we can. Need a bit of red and yellow. Let's do this. How much have we got? We need a bit more red, actually. Red, we're a bit low on. Alright, come on. We need a bit more red. Red is not spawning as much as I want it to. Alright, that should, that should be enough. We'll actually leave all that there and make it look nice and pretty. Alright, so let's go over here and let's create... Some flower, oh, not flowers, but let's create some dyes. So that's going to give me 10 dye. You're going to give me 14. So let's work down the list. So black, gray, light gray, can't do yet. Red wool, 10 red wool. Um, so one, two, three, four. And I think we just do it like this. So that's 10 red wool right there. Then there's also 10 yellow wool. So let's do 10 yellow wool. And let's do that. So then you got 10 red, 10 yellow. Then we need to make pink, 
orange, pink and orange. So that's 20. And then you have the three, two greys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So we need to go pink and orange. So we're going to need, we're going to need more of you because we need to get a whole bunch more red. So we don't, I don't think so we need, oh yeah, we do need a tiny bit of yellow, I guess. Uh, so we just need to keep doing this. Keep, I'm literally just holding both of them at the same time, just hoping to get more of each flower. So now I've done that. I've got four, to nine, and four. Okay, that has actually worked pretty well, actually. Um, let me do it a tiny bit more. We'll do it. We'll do it for another whole stack. So sorry if this is a bit loud for you guys. I'll try and edit the volume so it doesn't always seem too loud. I do that normally anyway. I always turn my volume down quite quite low during my recordings when when I render it for you guys because so, I always worry that it's up way too loud uh, I think I'm still gonna need more because uh, wait hold on orange uses red what wait, what what ones do we have orange and pink orange and pink yeah I still need three more red I think so let's just get a tiny bit more. Let's just do one more stack of these, and then we should be should be golden. All right, what have we got? Yeah, we got plenty. Wow, we got there's so much a huge ratio in between red and yellow. We got like twice the amount. So now uh, let's do that. So let's get red. And then, wow, we used, like, all that bone meal. Okay, so if we go that, and then take half of that, get more of that. If we do that and that, that's going to get us 10. And then I need to do pink. So then if I go here, let's just do some more of you. Then do red and white. That should give us pink, which it does there, so now we can do uh, orange and pink, and then it doesn't have like white or anything like that, so we literally have black, grey, and light grey, which both, all of them use ink sacs, so we need 30, 30 ink sacs? No. No, you need you need twenty. Cause you need ten black wool. Then you need ten to turn into grey. Oh, no, I think you do you only need five, so yeah, I think you only need like fifteen. Uh fifteen ink sacks. So that's a bit of a grind. We'll have to do a cut somewhere during the episode so I can do a grind on uh, some of those some of those guys. So what we're gonna do is we'll put the all them down there. We'll go here we'll just chuck out all our plants and dyes in here. Uh, we'll go. Uh, what else? We've got a huge amount, a whole bunch of seeds on us now. Uh, we can go mob drops, put you there. You can stay with us. And now let's do the final part of this episode and let's get the lake and the house built. So, the house, I think I'm just going to do as a little, a little shack actually. Uh, but one, two, three, four, five. We're going to come out ten, I think. Five, six, uh, seven, eight, nine, and ten. And now, this is going to be like where the walk. Oh, wait, no. Uh, this is where the walkway is going to be, not where these guys. And then, well, that's the edge. Then that's the walkway, and we're gonna have a little. We're gonna have two lakes like right next to us here. Um, how big do we want the lakes? One, two, three. Yeah, let's do four. They don't because what does it say? Make a small lake. It's not make a big lake. So we can make two small lakes, I guess. So then we can go one. Oh, that's two, three, four, uh, five. I guess like a. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. 
yeah, I guess I guess we can make them just like squares. Like they don't have to be detailed. They just have to be a pocket of water for it to spawn. And then I'll need to make these deeper. These probably will have to be like four blocks. Oh, and we need a fish as well. Okay, so we've got a few things to do this episode. So one, two, three, uh, four. Wait, one, two, three, four. And then we've got this. So yeah, we've got a few things to do this episode. So this episode might again also be a longer episode because I want to finish the majority of things today. I, I really want to finish all the challenges. Uh, I didn't place in the corner, it doesn't really matter, but it's going to annoy me if I don't do it. Um, so yeah, like we've got... this is They're going to turn into lakes, so uh, that's going to stay there just as for now. And then we can decorate the walls at the end. Uh, and then let's come out, let's go one, two, three, four. Or we have a walkway, then one, two, three... Four, five, walkway, wall. So this is how far out this is going to be, and this is where our house is going to be built. It's nothing fancy, just going to be maybe a bit of stone bricks, and yeah, we're just going to literally make a small little shack, I guess. It ain't going to be anything fancy. I was originally going to do like some sort of fancy house and stuff like that, but we don't really have that many options, you know, like... I could probably do some sort of fancy design with using some angles and stuff like that. But in the end, you know, it's only going to be around for this episode. It's not really, you know, I probably should have done it earlier on, I reckon, if I was going to do it a nice fancy house. So at least it got to last and we got to look at it a bit more. But, you know, that doesn't bother me too much. You know, in the end, the description just says, build a house. You know, what's a, a description of a house? It's practically... A room with a roof, that's a house. So technically, that is a house, and that mushroom area is a house. Even that is a house, technically. Uh, we, we could have classified that as the house, but I wanted to keep the storage separate to the actual um, sleeping area, I guess. And originally, I wanted to have... Um, like, we can't get shears or anything. I'm, I'm a bit annoyed. Um, no, uh, I haven't got any... Uh, whatchamacallit any ironing it's from zombies. I'm a bit annoyed by that because I wouldn't have mind making some shears and getting some of those leaves for a bit of decoration. So now, after we fill this in, how much cobble? Okay, we got plenty of cobble. Awesome. That's exactly what I wanted. So now I can fill this in. And then we need to, we need to fill these guys in, but we need to make it deeper. So, um... How are we going to do this? We need to get a bucket, and we need to get water, and we're going to make it... Um, where do I go? Here. So let's go here, and let's do this. So yeah, we need to make this deeper, because we need to make it so uh, we give us enough room for squid to spawn. And what I'm probably going to do, as, as I stated in the past... Uh, I probably will have to do a cut here because it, um, not like right now, but eventually, because it's a bit hard to, okay, uh, I don't want to keep the water, the bucket on me when I do this in case I die, because it's like the last thing I need to lose, because then I will have to farm uh, zombies even more just so I can get uh, a new bucket, which is um, much more painful than you'd think, because since I haven't had any luck now, it means it'd take me even longer like uh, to get it. So I need to do this, and we need to go one, two, three. So then if that's the base of the, uh, of this. So that means if I can, oh, I'm drowning. I wasn't paying attention to that. All right, so now what I can do so we can fill this in exactly how I want to fill it in. So let's do that. And there we go. So now we're going to have this lovely little, uh, two little ponds, I guess, at our, at our place. It's going to look really, really weird because there's going to be like, it's like extra thick, I guess. Because like, you know, like everything's like two too thick and then we're gonna have like this area which is like four or so which kind of sucks but oh well 
I guess we, we just, I, I, you can get squids technically spawning in a one source block, but the deeper it is, the better chance we have of actually getting them to spawn. So, um, what I will do is actually knock this out because this is just going to be a walkway for us to go over the lake, but this is actually going to be one big lake. I think that's how I'm going to do it. So now let's fill in this. Uh, so if I do that, that means that you can go there. And then let's just go over here and do that. Because now if I go here and now we're going to have ourselves a perfectly nice lake. We're going to need to fit, do some fishing as well. I don't know if I want to do that on camera either <laughs> with you guys, because that the fishing isn't exactly the most fun fun thing to watch. Um, but it is something that we do need to do. But it really is starting to come down to. Um... Okay, we need to get more. I was wondering what the hell that was then that fell there. <laughs> I thought it was a bat for a second, but no, it's just one of those mobs falling. So now we need to go here and go tools and this. So I think what I'm going to do, actually, is I'm going to go fill this in off camera. I'm going to farm some squids and I'm going to do some fishing because we need to do some fishing. And um, then we'll finish off those challenges because technically small lake is built. We just need to fill it. Um, we'll have you know, obviously two, two small lakes. Um, that's turned into a water source block, hasn't it? I think. Or has it? No, it didn't. Uh, let's do you. All right, we'll have to fill this in one by one, but it doesn't really matter. But um, yeah, so I will uh, do all that stuff off camera. So then the last thing we can do on camera is build the house and move the bed. And hopefully it's nighttime when we do it, because then we can set our spawn. And then we are done with Skyblock Survival. It will be all nice and finished, and we won't have to worry about it. So uh, I will see you guys in a second. Okay, guys, welcome back. Oh, man, this this takes takes some time. The bloody squids keep on getting in the way, though. Um, They, they spawn in here, but they spawn slowly. I think we've got... How many more? We've got, I think, two in there. I've, I've collected a bit of um, ink sacks. I've definitely got enough to do it. I'm just doing the fishing now, but I thought to start it back up because, uh, you know, we might, might as well. Uh, it doesn't seem to take too long, the fishing. Um, it says we need to cook ten fish. And I don't know if that means just this fish, or it doesn't matter if I cook raw salmon. Uh, I have, I guess, it's, since it's an older version, the, like the like the challenges, it doesn't really take into account that we have like salmon and puffer fish. Obviously, you can't cook puffer fish, but you can cook salmon. So I'm going to count the salmon. So it means that I need, I need to get four more fish. So that's not too bad. But then after that, uh, we can build the house, move the bed, and uh, then we will be we will be done. And as you can see, I've done a the same edits uh, to the island as I did uh, to the rest of it, like with the cobblestone fence around uh, to make it all pretty, did all the torches and did all that, so that wasn't too hard to do uh, since we had all the cobble. Don't really have that much cobble left though, uh, but we definitely have enough to finish off what we want. Uh, we've definitely got all the stone that's cooked in the furnaces and I still haven't touched in that one guy. One guy he likes swimming around there, I might have to kill him as well. But anyway, when this bobs, when it decides to, <laughs> it's actually taking its good old time. There we go. So we need two more fish, and then I can set them to cook. And then uh, then we can build the house, and then we are done, practically. Uh, it's quite weird that we're almost done, actually. And it's night time at the moment, so I wouldn't mind building this damn house whilst it's still night time. Uh, so we can set our spawn. Because I haven't deleted the bed yet, but I will have to break him in a second. So all those squids keep on going to that one corner that I'm fishing in. Might move over here and fish in this corner then instead. But uh, yeah, it's a bit weird that we're going to come and finish this. I, I thought this would actually take us longer this series, but I think I'm... Because I, I saw more challenges, so instantly I was like, you know what, it's going to take us longer to do it. But we've actually done it at a reasonable pace and a reasonable amount of episodes, personally, when I look at it. 
I think we will do one more episode after this. Uh, as I said, it might be a little special episode. I don't know. We might blow it up, or you know, we'll have a little fly around. You know, might we might blow it up. Let's be honest. We did that last time. We might as well do it again, I guess. And um, yeah, we'll see how the island looks afterwards. Oh, oh, we got water bottle. Oh yeah, that's right. Because you can get stuff from fishing. I haven't had any special items yet, so I still need one more damn fish. Oh, oh, there we go. All right, there. Oh, Enderman, Enderman dying. I still haven't got the Ender pearls. Where, where are you going to spawn? He's He's over there at the moment. Let's let's go fight him. Ah, he's under the under cover. There we go. Another Ender Pearl. All right. Well, I'm still I'm still two Ender Pearls off um off the challenge, unfortunately. So don't think so. That one's gonna count. Uh, it's gonna take me a while. Like I could really, but it's two Ender Pearls. I don't think so. It's really gonna matter. Um, let me grab some wood here. And we'll cook this fish, and we'll cook that fish, and then we'll have our our fish all nice and cooked, and then we don't have to worry about it. Uh, let's put this here, and now let's do the final wall challenges that we needed to do. So, uh, I think I need, I don't know if I have enough really, because um, we got ten. So there's 10 black wool, and then I need to do, uh, where did I put you? I got you in there, did I set plants? I got you in there as well. Uh, I need to do, uh, what, what do we need? There's 10 that we need, and then if we do that, and then technically that, that's what we need because then we go light grey oh bugger I made, I made one too many uh, that's okay, we still have still have plenty plenty of wool and string to go around uh, and then I could do that and go normal grey and there we go, that's all the wool blocks made, which I think are probably the most tedious of the challenges like we still Technically needed to make green and dark green, but unfortunately, or lime green and green, but unfortunately, since we lost that cactus so early on, we actually can't complete those challenges, but I'm not overly too fussed, to be honest. Now, I know there is a whole bunch of stone still in these guys. I haven't taken them out, because I purposely put them in there ages ago to cook up for this. So now we're going to go over here, and... <laughs> I don't know if you guys can hear that, but I can like hear like a massive revving going on outside. I think like some some guys hooning outside my house. I don't know if you guys can hear that. It's really weird. <laughs> um, all right, so now what we're gonna do is that we're gonna make a um, maybe just like a cobblestone little house, uh, like a stone house or something. So let's do that. Um, and this is all it is going to be. It's nothing going to be much. We're going to have like the bed just here. Uh, and that's really going to be it. I want to actually make a few stairs because we might do a tiny bit of detail. Might make a few slabs as well. Make it kind of a bit detailed, but nothing too much really. So let's do that. Um, let's take half of you. And let's do that, even though I don't really need that much of any of them really. But it's all about just trying to make a tiny bit of detail in the house. Let's break you. And let's pick you up and move you there. And sleep the night and set our spawn in here. And the last thing we'll need to do is put a door on here as well when it's done. But what I wouldn't mind doing is doing like some sort of window sort of design uh, going here. So we can, we can do this on all of them. It's not too much. We don't we don't we don't have any glass, so we can't actually do the detail I, that I would actually normally want to do. But that's nothing too much of an issue, I guess. It's um it's a bit of annoyance that we did lose all that glass at the, and like the sand. That would have that would have been really really helpful if uh, we still had that around. But what we can do now is that I can Fill in all these, 
then we can do a tiny bit of detail in the windows by putting upside down stairs, you know, as if there actually was windows here, but we don't have any glass, unfortunately. But you know, it, it makes it look like an actual building, so to say. Oh, damn it. And uh, then after this bits of detail, and then we need to go up here. And you know what? Why not do it like this? Yeah, let's. Yeah, okay, we're gonna do that. So we'll go grab the uh, oak wood. That's what I want to grab. Uh, we'll go put all this in its chest. So stone brick can all go in here. Uh, I can put away this stuff. I'm not gonna use you actually. Uh, stone can go in here. I don't know why I left you in there. Uh, cobblestone can go back in here. Uh, this can go in other. And then oh, I'll put you in here. Then what do I, was I coming for? That's right, oak wood I was coming in here for. So I'll grab you and you. And we'll convert some of you. We'll turn you into stairs. And we'll turn you into slabs. Then hopefully that's enough. We also need to make a oak door. So we can do that. And then we have done our final bits of detail, and then we are finally done with this season of Skyblock Survival, which is a bit a bit set. Oh yeah, I can't really do that. I was going to do like a overhang, but then it blocks the window. Um, that's okay. What we can do is kind of just do it from here, I guess. So if I do, I'm going to do like a wooden roof. It's like the first bit of wood I'm going to use as detailing in here. Maybe, maybe it's. Maybe it's a good thing. I was going to do like wooden trims and wooden floors everywhere, but again, it's it's tedious work that doesn't really need to be done, I guess. So I can just place like these in the corners, like so. And no, not like that. Uh, let's get rid of you. Yeah, because I, originally I had plans of putting like stone and wood all along the floorways. Like I was going to have all the pathways as like oak wood or like birch wood or something like that to make it all nice and fancy. But again, it's it's tedious stuff that doesn't really need to be done. It's like, you know, it makes it aesthetically look nice. But again, it's it's tedious work that is probably a waste of time. But there we go. The last thing we need to do is place that good old doorway on here. Oh, and break this. Um, it, it does look a bit weird how the roof at the moment. <laughs> I do admit the roof does look a tiny, tiny bit weird. But there we go. There's our house all nice and done. And, uh, you know, maybe, maybe, put, maybe put like a shelving unit or something here. Although it actually looks really, really, really weird uh, there, but I don't have an axe to break it all down, so I'm gonna break it with my fist. Yeah, it's too, it's too tall for uh, for here because how we got the window set up. But what we will do is uh, after I break these, I know the last little bits of detail I'll do in here, and then that will conclude this series of um, Skyblock Survival. So we'll do that for bedside tables, and that's probably the best we can do. Ah, wow. So we are finally done every challenge. Uh, we can go back over here and look. But oh, the only challenge we haven't done is the Ender Pearls. We're too off. Um, I probably could sit around and wait for it, but I'm not too fussed. There we go. We got four cooked salmon, delicious fish, and six more there. So that's the food cooked all there that we needed. And, um, yeah, that's that's really it. We've done everything we need to but the ender pearls. And, obviously, we didn't do the cactus green dye. We didn't do the bookshelves because uh, you needed cows for that. We didn't get any luck with cows, unfortunately, or any mobs spawning here. Or matter. I was kind of hoping for another sheep, another Steve I was hoping for. But, uh, yeah, we didn't craft lime green wool, green wool, or six glass panes because... Oh, 16 glass panes because how we lost that island so early on. But I think overall we've recovered quite well and we've done we've done reasonably well with the resources that we had and um, you know I'm happy that we've completed all the challenges in the time frame that we have. So um, I think for this final time, guys, we might have another episode after this uh, where we might have a little fly around and then maybe a bit of destruction. But as in challenge-wise and actual normal survival playing, 
I think it's the final time I'm going to play in survival on this map. So as usual, guys, thank you all for watching. I hope you all have an awesome day. Thank you all for watching this series and enjoying it. I sure as hell have, and I know a few of you have as well. So as usual, catch you guys later.